111 Murray Street is a brand new construction in the epicenter of Tribeca. And again, my name is Jason Matuk. I'm a realtor in South Florida, but I'm on vacation to show you some of the most beautiful homes for sale in New York City. So as we come on in, we're gonna head, make a right really quick. We'll save these bedrooms for after the kitchen, but I just want to get to this area to start. We have a half bathroom. Half bathrooms in New York City, that's already impressive, but it's just the size. Let's just take a look at this. Now, don't be fooled. We're not in Miami. This is just Florida-sized living in New York City. It's really special. Another thing that you don't see very often that's also extremely rare and very impressive is this. You have a so you, you could call this a coat closet if you, I don't know, if you didn't have a good vocabulary because this is more than just a coat closet. This is an, a walk-in with shoe rack, with your suit rack. You can fit everything you need in here. So this is great if you have a guest or if you just had like a summer wardrobe or a winter wardrobe that's you want to switch it from season to season while you're living here. It's perfect for that. And then as we come on in, obviously this is going to be a breathtaking experience because this is, this is the main attraction. This is where the entertainment is going to happen. You're going to watch some TV here. You're going to cook some great dinner here. And you know what your views are while you're cooking dinner? Just nothing but water. So let's talk about the kitchen first. And so on top of having just this modern upgraded kitchen, because this, this unit was built in 2018, so you're going to get that modern fresh feel. You have the best of the best appliances. You have Wolf appliances, you have Mila microwave, and then you have a wine cooler, Wolf ovens. And then one of the things I really, of course, like is when the paneling matches from the cabinetry to the fridge and this another pantry over here so on top of all the storage space pantry and then I love when the panels match with the fridge and you have this really elegant sub-zero fridge hidden with storage above the, I mean this is pretty much the talk of the whole room you have floor to ceiling windows overlooking the bay it's just really beautiful and then you're at the top of every other building so you really have no one to be able to look in and on top of that you also have a privacy shade so it's all remote, it's all motorized, so you click this and all the shades come down and you're in total privacy while you're enjoying a nice evening. Now, just one thing that I really like about this room, that TV would never even be turned on because I'd be spending 95% of my time enjoying the outside, looking at it in, in, just in amazement. It, this is the kind of place you walk in and you're in shock for about 10 minutes. And then a just great little formal place to eat if you're not on the bar stool, if you wanna have a proper elegant dinner, underneath this amazing light fixture. So from here, we're actually gonna take a look down at the bedrooms, and this is a three bedroom, three and a half bathroom. So let's take a look. All right, so coming down from the kitchen, we're gonna take a look at bedroom number one. And the way that, the first thing that I noticed about this bedroom that was very cool, I can tell someone designed it on purpose, is when you walk in, they have a pocket door, so you can obviously slide the door closed, but when you keep it open, the first thing you see when you walk in is not a wall or a door, the first thing you see is these are these views. So really, really appreciate that. And then just look how peaceful, this is like, if you type in, <laughs> I love using this phrase, but if you, if you type in best views in New York City, this is the kind of stuff you're gonna see. Look at the space in here. Remember that we're in New York City. Look at the size of the bed and the space around it leading into its ensuite bathroom. All the bedrooms here have an ensuite bathroom. And again, it's just very spacious, a nice walk-in shower with really tall ceilings and almost a full body mirror. It's everything you'll need. And of course, one of the features we're gonna to wanna to point out while we're here are the closets. So let me just quickly show the closet here more than enough space and again if you needed more space than this you do have that closet right down the hall so it's perfect all right so we're going to make our way to the right and take a look at the second bedroom now this one's even in my opinion it feels a little bit bigger and the way they have it set up is a child's bedroom so it's a bunk bed with an with a desk in here so you have a, a bunk bed and a desk and a closet and still look at the amount of space we have it's not crammed there's a vibe going on here it's very rustic and wooden and then again like every bedroom you're going to have these unobstructed views of the water it's really really beautiful and just really impressive <laughs> yeah it's very beautiful and very impressive but yeah so and then we'll take a look right behind the beds where they have the closet so take a look at this closet a nice long closet and as i said before if this isn't enough for you which i know it's going to be enough you have the closet down the hall because this room has an ensuite it's going to look spectacular now this one instead of having a walk-in has a tub and you can just i love the design of the tub everything is so modern and sleek very clean and then the, 
I really appreciate the height of these ceilings. Nice sink, nice bathroom. Just really, it, it, I keep having to remind myself that in New York, it's so impressive. But the one thing that is also very impressive is, so having a laundry room in a unit in New York is, is always awesome to have, and you're always gonna have it in a luxury place like this, but the way they have this laundry room, it actually has shelves and storage. On, so you have your washer, your dryer, and then you have shelves and storage. This is your a laundry room in New York. So cool. And then right off, so it's next to all your bedrooms, very convenient. We're gonna go take a look at possibly one of the most breathtaking master bathrooms that I have personally ever seen. And I've seen a lot of them. I've seen quite a few, you know, quite a few areas. Let's take a look at this one. So as you come on in, imagine waking up every morning, you throw the shades up, you say good morning to the world, and this is what you're looking at. You have the one trade center right there in all of its glory. And I'm talking, you can see everything about it. And the great thing about views like this, it's a full body view of the building. So you can really appreciate it for what it is. If you look in the distance, I'm not sure the camera can catch it. You can see the bridge all the way down in the back. So you have almost like a, a portrait back there. This is, this is a photography. If you're an influencer, if you're someone who's on social media a lot, this is where the, the outfit of the day is going. You're taking it right here. One of these, yeah, real nice. And then you have a wraparound view to look at the other side of the water. So this is just a place where, once again, TVs are not required. You pretty much don't need one because why do you need a TV if you live here? You got the city, that's your TV. We're gonna take a look at the bathroom. The bathroom is just as impressive as the room itself. So when you come on in, I was really, this is, this is like a dream bathroom. If you, if you had to like come up with it in your head, this is pretty much how it would look. Everything is just sleek and clean and look up. The fixtures are just so, everything is very detailed. I can tell someone put like a lot of love into this. I love the light, how it goes around the frame. It just, you know when you go into a dressing room and you look better than real life? That's, it's giving you that, that better than real life look. I really, really like it. And then nice and hidden behind frosted glass, you have the toilet, a full body mirror. You're obviously gonna need a full body mirror so you can see what, you, what you're working with. And then a beautiful walk-in shower. And the thing that I really like about the walk-in shower is they have a new design on that wall in the back and it just changes the flow. It's done really well. Shower head on the ceiling, a must have, honestly. And then the cream of the crop. This is, this is, the, this is the point where you're most impressed. You, you know what you're, <laughs> if, I, if I didn't have any class, I would get in there and show you, but you literally lay in here and you're looking at that beautiful building overlooking the city, overlooking the best views that you can get for this price. It's quite shocking. Just, just Billy, I'm gonna give you a second to visualize yourself here, stay there. Coming right off from the master bathroom and the bedroom, a walk-in closet. And this is not just, and this is honestly a walk-in closet that you see in homes, like single family houses. It's in your condo. It's honestly breathtaking. Wraparound storage, more than enough space for both people, or if it's just someone who's single, plenty of space. All right, well, I really appreciate you taking the time to come with me on this tour again. This is a New York series, so we're gonna have a few properties to show you, and they're gonna be listed right here. Feel free to like, subscribe, follow, share. Again, I wanna give a shout out to the listing agents. Really appreciate them giving me the opportunity. And if you have any questions, their contact information will be down below. Thank you.